Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day. Yay! No. Three. Yes. Vlogmas Day three. It is Sunday morning and I have been up out early this morning doing Avon deliveries, which um, is good fun. I quite enjoy doing that. We should have been out earlier for Phoebe's swimming lesson, but Phoebe was feeling poorly this morning. Yes. But she's all right. We have just... improved dramatically and she has a dance rehearsal this afternoon for her big dance show next weekend which we're looking forward to. Yeah. So that's what we're going to do later and Archie has a football match which I don't think anyone can go and watch unfortunately because we've got dance rehearsal and, and Andrew is at work again and, today. Um, I'm going to the cinema with Archie to see Wonder. Are you? Yeah. When? Archie said. When? After dance rehearsal. News to me, apparently they're going to the cinema. What, Daddy taking you? I don't know who's taking me, he didn't tell me. He didn't tell me who's taking me. Maybe Archie's treating you. I doubt it. He can't drive. No, I don't think they're going to the cinema. Tomorrow is also a special day. Why is tomorrow a special day? Because it's Lucy's birthday. Oh no, it's Lucy's today. birthday today. No, tomorrow, what's happening tomorrow? Oh, tomorrow, it's my exam. Yes, Phoebe's got two dance exams tomorrow, her primary tap and her grade one modern exam. Yeah. So we were a bit worried when she wasn't feeling too well yesterday and this morning, but hopefully she's back on form and she'll be able to take her exam. So she's missing the morning of school and Andrew's taking the day off work to be dance dad for the day. <laughs> and dance dad. Dance dad. And, um, and then she'll be back at school for the afternoon. And so I'm sure she will do brilliantly because and she's I done will... lots of practice. And I will not be there for lunch either. I'll be having lunch at McDonald's. Apparently they're having McDonald's. We'll see. Anyway, we're about to go to Tesco's to do a food shop, which is so exciting. And then we'll be home. Yeah. And probably take the dog for a walk. So yeah. we will see you then. And I'll be on my bike. Oh, she's going on a bike. See you in a bit. My new bike. So it is 20 to four. And if you watched my video yesterday, Oh no, I said that I seem to spend half my life sat in the car driving children to different events and activities. Well, today is no different. As I said this morning, Phoebe has dance rehearsal this afternoon and Archie's had football. And I feel like I have spent most of the day in the car. I have been home, but not for long. So apologies for the content today, because it's minimal. I've done nothing. I did Avon deliveries, Avon books, to catch the football. And now Phoebe's in the theater strutting her stuff ready for her performance next week and i am in tesco's got myself a costa though so i'm going to drink this and go back to the theater and perhaps do a bit of work while i wait for her to finish and then we're going home andrew has finished work and hopefully he's going to put the dinner on so that dinner is ready when we get home and that's our sunday that's pretty much all we've done so apologies this is rubbish um might do a bit of a christmas house tour later to give you a bit of something interesting to see And that's it. about half past eight in the evening and um, I'm gonna finish the vlog shortly but I thought it would be nice as we've had very little going on today to do a little house tour and show you what our Christmas decorations look like um, I don't really have any particular theme I pick up decorations every year that I like and I'm a typical Libran I can't choose I like everything there's not one particular style that I like or don't like so We've got a mishmash of everything throughout the house and I like it that way. Um, so I thought I'd show you what we've got. 
and we'll start in our hallway over here so on our front door we've got our wreath on the other side I probably won't be able to see it let's have a look whoops there we go our wreath is a star it has got lights on it but we haven't got them working at the moment but it's a star it's quite an unusual one but we like that one we've had that one for a few years now so that's our star and then on the back bungo come on bungo come on come on in and on the back of the door, we've got these hearts, which I bought. I've got a jewellery um, jewelry party thing that I went to years ago now. And I really like them. They're kind of glittery, aren't they? You can see they're glittery on there. Um, but I love those. Uh, so they hang on the back of the door. Um, and then on this side, we, we've got this cushion, which I bought in Home Sense last Christmas, which I absolutely love. Um, this here is a card holder, and that's going to go here on this wall. I just need to buy a hook to put it on. Um, and up here we've got our monthly planner, which you might have seen from my um, Home Sense haul that I did back in November. Um, and I want to get some holly or something to put over the top to make it a bit more festive. Um, I also have a printable in this frame here, which is currently the autumn one. That my printer decided not to work, so I haven't been able to put a Christmas one in there, but there will be a Christmas one in there. So that's that side. The dog comes free for Christmas. Um, and then on this side we've got a mirror and we've got this Noel heart uh, wreath hanging on top there. So I like that. Um, then over here, I've got this welcome sign, which I bought from Nebworth Christmas Fair a couple of Christmases ago, which I love. And this little sign says, Christmas cheer is welcome here. And I've got a little hanging cinnamon stick thing with a heart on the bottom there, which I really like. So that's the hallway. Um, we've come into my office. Again, I've got, excuse the mess, I've got some printables on the wall here, and those will change to Christmas ones when my printer decides to work. Um, so I've changed this completely. Last year I had lots of reds and things up here and this year I've gone for sort of a rose gold effect. So this sign here, this joy sign, is um, a metal sign which I bought from Wilco um, along with this Christmas tree here. And then I had some copper wire lights that I bought from Primark. I think they were two pounds and I've wrapped them around and I think that looks really effective. I love that rather than just having the plain sign. Again, I'm gonna have some Christmassy printables in there. And then I've got this little Christmas candle holder also from Wilco, which I need to put a candle in. Um, and that's really all I've got in here that's Christmassy. So that's my office. And then in the kitchen, we've got this lovely wreath here on the door, which I th oh, don't know where I bought that from. That might have been from Nebworth Christmas Fair as well. Um, and then we've got our tree down here. Now this tree has a bit of history to it. We bought this tree on Andrew, mine and Andrew's very first Christmas together 17 years ago um, and it's still going strong we uh, get it up every year we keep it we look after it and keep it boxed in the same box that we bought it in and this one goes in the kitchen and the children decorate it and it's got all of their special decorations excuse me dog nothing out there. What? There's nothing here. There's nothing there. Look. Empty. There's nothing there. Shush. I'll leave the door open. Anyway, uh, as I was saying, it's got lots of Christmas decorations that they've made themselves. Um, and a little one that Phoebe made this year. And um, lots of things from when Andrew and I were first together. The first lot of decorations that we bought. Um, for our tree so that one is sort of a memory tree really and um, we've got much else in here there's a couple of these hanging things I bought these from Aldi I think two Christmases ago um, and this is the first Christmas I've actually managed to put them up let's shut this door sorry dog Move your feet. Uh, we've got a candle on the table which we have and then over here oh, I usually have a different picture up here but I like this one it's about a uh, delicious yuletide roast turkey and it's got different recipes and things that you can put with your roast turkey. I've got some little bits here. I've got my uh, fresh baked cookie candle, which came, comes from B&M. I've got a little chef gingerbread man here, and another gingerbread man in a, in a basket, in a bag. And then over here is my 
one of my favourite decorations, which um, it says, have yourself a Merry Chris Little Christmas, and it's a jar filled with Christmassy lights. And I bought that last year at Nebworth Christmas Fair. And up here, we've got a big snowman. It says 22 days until Christmas. Important to remember that. Um, and that's it, I think. Oh, I've got a little um, reindeer chalkboard there for writing things that I need. Right, we'll go upstairs. So if we come up the stairs, we've got Mr. Snowman, who sits there on the stairs. He's sat there for the last couple of years since we moved in every Christmas, keeping an eye on us all. Um, we've got a little garland here hanging on the banister and these jingle bells that sit there as well, which I love. Had those for years, I have no idea where I bought them from or where I got this from either. Uh, I've got another card holder hanging there with no cards on it yet because it's too early for cards. Um, and then as we go into the lounge, if you watched yesterday's Vlogmas, you will remember the tree, but this is our tree. We always have a real tree upstairs. And I love this one. I think it's a great shape. This is a great space. We've got um, French windows, which obviously only go out to a little balcony there. So it's a space that's not really used that much. So it's a great place to put the tree. So that's there. And then over here, we've got this Noel sign, which has some candles on it, which I've not got lit at the moment. We've got my winter spice uh, uh, reed diffuser that I got from Primark. And then up here, the little present stack of lights. I think they came from Dunelm Mill many moons ago and four little gold Christmas trees. And then I like to swap out some of our pictures for Christmas, more Christmassy ones. So I've got um, this one here of the reindeer, which I think came from Dunelm Mill. Got a little part of the Christmas sitting there. And then we've got there, believe in the magic of Christmas. There. And then come over here, Mr. Clark sitting, sitting there, doing some work. Um, got Father Christmas here, a few little bits around, candles. I love this star here, which I think came from Home Sense, as did this last Christmas. And then we've got our fireplace and mantelpiece, which is my favourite bit, really. One of the reasons I wanted a fireplace was so that I could put a garland on it. It's not lit up, actually, it does light up. We've got Merry Christmas banner along the top, and then we've got some other bits and pieces, mandatory stocking hanging down, and then Father Christmas and Rudolph, just checking everyone's okay at the bottom there. We've got some other little trinkets that sit around. A Noel sign and a few little bits over here. And my cushions, which are my favourites, which I bought from Asda, um, which were six pounds and I just got them this year. From Asda, I've got that one there and then this one here, which I absolutely love. And over here, I've got my Home Sense one, which you'll have seen in my Home Sense haul if you've seen it. If not, go and check it out. I'll link it below. And that's that one, which is the postcard one. And there are lots of other little trinkets around the house, in the bedrooms and things, but I won't bother showing you those. There's lots, lots of little bits and pieces. And that's it. That's our Christmas home tour. So I hope you enjoyed it. So I hope you enjoyed today's vlog, Vlogmas Day 3. Um, sorry if it was a bit bitty and not that interesting. Um, things are uh, busy sometimes at the weekends. No, I will always do my best to give you something that's relatively fun to watch. Um, tomorrow is work day for me, as is Tuesday, so there may not be a video up until Wednesday or Thursday. But if we can video something and I can put it up, then I will do. Thanks again for watching. If you enjoyed it and if you want to watch more videos like, that, like this, then please subscribe below or on the little Clark Life sign that is here I think um, you click on that and it, you can subscribe and um, give us a thumbs up and we will see you next time